Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, hi, my name is Lavinia, and I post beauty videos regarding makeup and skincare. We talk about all things acne positivity, skincare. We do skincare trials, makeup trials, all things beauty on this channel um, while keeping it very skin positive. So if that's something you're interested in, I would love for you to join my channel by hitting the big red subscribe button. Today, I'm going to be doing a haul from Look Fantastic US. I got my box here. <laughs> I'm so excited for this. We have lots of products to go through and some stuff I picked out from the website. I, one of my favorite things to do is shop skincare. Um, and I have had a very stressful past few weeks with just the school semester, you know, kicking into high gear and everything like that. And one of my favorite things to do to try to de-stress is buying skincare and shopping for skincare so I'm so excited to um, go through this haul with you guys and US Look Fantastic is also offering all of you guys 22% off their website um, there are certain exclusions but for the most part you can use the code Lavinia as well as the link down below in the description to get 22% off your purchase oh you tell me stories you tuck me in and the second you leave all right so you know what let's dive right into this haul i am so excited so we actually have a lot of affordable products here i think there's just one product that's more on the pricey side so actually let's just start with that one so this first product is from juice beauty this is what this looks like right here and this is the bamboo pore refining mask Ooh, this looks exciting I am so excited about this. I love face masks, especially, you know, as I said, with stressful times, not only do I love skincare shopping, but masks are like my other favorite de-stressor. So this is what this product looks like right here. And it has clinically validated results. Interesting. So combining the benefits of bamboo, charcoal, clay, aloe, and aspen bark with polyhydroxy acids to help detox and protect against daily pollutants, leaving a softer looking, smoother, and more even complexion. So I don't really believe in skincare being able to detox. And this is definitely kind of claiming to be a detoxing mask. If you have a liver, then your body does detoxing on its own. Skincare is not going to do that, but I know that is usually a marketing claim that is used. Um, but we'll have to see what this mask does. I've actually heard good things about it. It kind of smells like, smells like roses almost. Yeah, like flowers. It kind of smells like. Well, I'm excited to try this out. Um, this seems very interesting and I cannot wait to try out a new mask. Let me know if you guys want a video on that. I'll probably do something on over on TikTok with this one. Okay, next brand we have some stuff from um, is Cozar X. I am really interested in getting to know Cozar X products better. Um, so I picked out three products that I am super excited to try. So first off, we have the BHA Blackhead Power Liquid. But, so Cozar X is a Korean skincare brand that has made its way over to North America. They're pretty affordable. You can find them at drugstores too. And they have some pretty cool products, but I have not tried too much from the line actually. So this right here is a BHA liquid. And if you don't know what BHA is, um, also known as salicylic acid, it's really, it's oil soluble. So it's really good at getting deep into the pores and exfoliating. Um, so this is gonna really help with blackheads, kind of unclogging the pores of any dead skin cells that have built up and also really helping with acne. Um, so this is what this product looks like right here. It comes with a little pump. Now I have been a long time lover of the Paula's Choice 2% BHA liquid exfoliant. And I'm interested in how this product will compare to that one. This is a 4% BHA. Um, so this I am very, very excited to try. We also have niacinamide in here, sodium hyaluronate, willow bark water, panthenol. Okay, yeah, I'm super excited to try this. Honestly, with this product, I might have to do a two week trial and maybe compare it to the Paula's Choice since that one has been one of my favorites. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. I'm super excited about it. And then I also got the Blemish Spot Clearing Serum. So this is what the product looks like right here. It comes in a little dropper serum bottle. Okay, so this has propolis extract, butylene glycol, niacinamide, panthenol, tea tree leaf oil, ceramide. Okay, this is really interesting. Glycerin, sunflower oil, sodium hyaluronate and then we have centella okay 
I am very intrigued by this because, you know, it's not your typical acne product with salicylic acid something that seems to be super harsh so it seems like the main things in here that are going to help with spots is like centella and soothing the skin and that tea tree um so i'm very very like intrigued by this um and hopefully it's like one of those acne products that's actually really soothing to the skin and you can use a more sensitive skin because hello i have very dry and sensitive skin but also acne prone skin so this sounds interesting i'm definitely excited to test that out and the last product from Cozar X is this right here. This is the Centella Blemish Cream. It's enriched with Centella Asiatica um, extract, and it's going to help calm and soothe the sensitive, irritated area. So this product really caught my eye on the website because whenever I see an acne product that's also for like soothing and sensitive skin, I like have to try it out right away. So this just comes in a little jar. Ooh, it kind of smells like tea tree oil and this is what it looks like right here it's just a cream i want to feel the texture of this okay, it's like kind of thicker than i imagined it i am very excited about this because as i said i have very dry skin and very sensitive skin but i also struggle with acne and finding those products that can target both those issues can be kind of tough and we have glycerin here that centella leaf water we even have zinc oxide um that's probably what's giving it this more white thicker consistencies because of that zinc in there tea tree yeah that's probably where we're getting that scent from yeah like there's no harsh actives in here which is really interesting so i cannot wait to try these products out um maybe we'll do like a full cozer x video moving on um i have a product from bybee this is what this looks like right here and I've actually been trying a few products from Bybee over the past few weeks. I've been trying their cleansers out. Their Bakuchio oil is amazing. I've been really enjoying that as well as their strawberry oil. But this right here is the Bakuchio Skin Restore Lightweight Night Cream. Um, I have been really getting into Bakuchio products lately and I find them so interesting because Bakuchio is a plant-based alternative to retinol. It's been studied and seen that it has those similar effects to retinol in being good at providing cell turnover to the skin so this is what the cream looks like and let's see what is in here so we have aloe leaf juice um, as like the solvent not water we have grapeseed oil shea butter the bakuchio lavender flower oil and then we do have some essential oils in here i'm not the biggest fan of those but i'm definitely interested to try this out see what the texture is like because i've been a big fan of their bakuchiol like oil that one is straight up squalene and bakuchiol so it's like very very simple formula whereas this one has some more stuff to it oh yeah it definitely smells very very essential oil strong fragrance um but yeah i'm gonna have to try this out maybe even in combination with the bakuchiol oil and see what my skin thinks of it Next up, let's move on to Revolution Beauty. I do have another Bakuchio product, so we'll make that perfect transition. I'm very curious about Revolution Skincare. Um, I haven't tried much from them. I've tried their makeup and they make some great affordable products. So their skincare is definitely intriguing because they have some products with great actives in there at high percentages for very affordable prices. So this is the Bakuchi Oil um, Moisture Cream. It's vegan, cruelty-free, and fragrance-free we love to hear that and this is what the product looks like right here i love this packaging it's so cute is this literally a purple moisturizer oh <gasps> it is oh my gosh are you kidding me that's so beautiful it literally looks like a dessert i want to eat it um but this doesn't have a fragrance to it from what i can tell Ooh, that feels nice I'm so excited to try this out on the face. I'm definitely gonna have to start testing this because it seems like something I'll really enjoy. So yeah, I've been getting into those Bakuchio products and this seems like an interesting moisturizer since it's fragrance-free and has that ingredient in there. And another product I got from Revolution is their Retinol. It's the super intense 1% serum. It's a light and silky advanced retinol oil blended with 1% pure retinol to help condition skin tone and texture. Again, vegan, cruelty-free, and fragrance-free. 
Oh, and I love that they say better skincare, better makeup. I am a true believer in that. Literally, the key to making your makeup look good is your skincare prep that you do underneath. So I love that they said that. This is what the product looks like right here. It comes in this beautiful purple bottle. We've got that dropper. It's like a green yellow color. Let's see. Yeah, it feels like an oil. No fragrance really. I'm excited to try this. And sometimes with retinols, like you, it's hard to find good, like affordable options. And at 1%, this seems like a good start off retinol for someone just getting into it. We do have coconut oil in here, which that's a little concerning just because sometimes my skin can be like a little sensitive. But other than that, it seems really cool and I'm definitely excited to test it out. All right, and the last two products in the box are from Pixie. I got two sprays from them. The first one is the Hydrating Milky Mist. So this has hyaluronic acid and oat in it. You know what, I wanna open this up right now and apply it. I have seen people use this all over, like social media on TikTok and stuff. And I've always wanted to try it out because I feel like it would just make your makeup look really pretty and just your skin too. Like this obviously like a skincare product as well, but should I just, I'm just going to apply it over my makeup. Ooh, that mist is really nice. Very like hydrating from what I can tell. What do we think? So this is a feather light mist on moisturizer. This is so cool, honestly. Like sometimes, I don't know if you guys get this, but um, especially now that I'm back in school, I have to wear a mask a lot of the times. So my skin gets so dry throughout the day, but you don't want to like touch your face if you can't like wash your hands or anything like that. So this might be something I'm going to like put in my bag, spray throughout the day and like hydrate and moisturize my skin on the go since it's a spray. But this is awesome, honestly. Like it says you can kind of use this anytime for a burst of hydration, in between layers, all of that. Wow, I'm actually so excited to start using this. And with that oat in there and that hyaluronic acid, it seems like a good one. And the next spray we have from Pixie is their Sun Mist. Um, this has chamomile and bamboo extract and it's a broad spectrum SPF 30. I absolutely love these spray on sunscreens because Again, for reapplication, they're great. And if you're a makeup wearer, you need something that won't shift your makeup underneath. But you still want to be applying your um, sunscreen multiple times a day. So let's see what this is all about. Um, so this has titanium dioxide, amylosate, octanosate, and octosalate as the filters in here. Let's spray this on. Okay, so not as flawless and feather light as the milk one. Um, we can definitely see, maybe I didn't mix it. Let's see. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, let's do this. Spray it on like that and then I'm gonna grab my sponge and pat it into the skin. So it literally doesn't look like I sprayed paint on my face because that's what it's giving right now. <laughs> I might have to mess around with that a bit more and figure out how to use it properly. I think like for a spray sunscreen, a lot of them do that, but leaving the skin pretty glowy. I think if you have like something to pat it in, like a sponge or a brush, it might work well. And it's actually looking pretty good on the skin, even on top of my makeup. But this is interesting to me, you know, SPF 30 in a spray bottle, that seems really, really cool. I'm definitely excited to start wearing this more and kind of having it with me on the go when I need a reapplication of sunscreen. And there you have it, guys. That is the last product we had in the unboxing from Look Fantastic. 
Remember, you can use the code LAVINIA for 22% off your purchase, which is quite a bit, so save some money. And a lot of these products I showed you guys today are already affordable, but if you can save more money on them, why not? If you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and also make sure to turn on my post notifications so you get notified every single time I upload a new video. And if you want to see more of my content, you can go check me out on the Acne channel. I'm a weekly host on there. We talk about all things skincare and education, so it's a very good informative channel if you yourself are an acne warrior. And for more daily content, you can go check me out on Instagram and TikTok at Lavinia Rosanda. Hope you're having a fantastic day or night whenever you're watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye! Oh, you tell me stories You tuck me in and the second you leave, I call you right back to check for monsters.